Greece. Just the name of the country evokes a long and illustrious history of a maritime civilization. I travel to the port city of Piraeus, close to Athens, in search of echoes of the country's ancient past. Also, I was intrigued by a fascinating new chapter of the country's biggest port, in collaboration with China, another ancient civilization half a globe away. Let's take a trip along the port's over 20 kilometers long of coastline. And I discovered that what goes on here involves much more than just moving containers. But let's start with some history. These are remnants of the city walls that once guarded the port in ancient times. And there's also a statue replica of either Zeus or Poseidon, depending on whether he holds a thunderbolt or trident. During the classical period, Piraeus was the busiest district of Athens and its biggest industrial zone. The exact spot of this museum used to be a factory for warships in the 4th century BC. These are the triremes that we see in movies, documentaries, and video games. And this metal part is here so that you can ram into enemy ships and deal substantial damage. This is the Hellenic Maritime Museum in Piraeus, where you can see how Greek ships evolved through the ages. It's based on centuries of maritime tradition. Greece is an oceanic country. Its beauty is sculpted by the artist known as the sea. A short distance from the museum, the port of Piraeus, now managed by a Chinese company. How did this collaboration between two equally ancient civilizations come about? Stay tuned for the next episode. <laughs>